The CDC says they are keeping a close eye on protests across the country since it's tough to social distance in large crowds. Health officials also worry that the use of chemical agents like tear gas will cause people to cough, helping spread the virus. They say if you've been a part of a protest, think about getting tested. North Carolina reported more than 900 new cases. That's the lowest number we've seen in days, but the seven day rolling average is still trending up. An important number we track is the percentage of tests that come back positive. That stated about 10%. There are nearly 700 people hospitalized from the virus across the state. South Carolina is reporting 370 new cases. That's again a drop compared to the last couple of days. The percentage of positive tests still slightly above 9%. Novon Health is relaxing its visitation policy that's been in place since March. Starting tomorrow at Novon Hospitals, you can have one person come with you, and there is no end time for visiting hours for people in critical care and surgery. At Novon Clinics, you can have one person with you if the patient is 65 or older or under 18. Exceptions can be made, but you have to call ahead of time.